Um, the, mo the most important thing for, uh, for a normal person who wants to go to, to high altitude is to take your time to do it. So a lot of people try and climb Kilimanjaro, it's very popular. They try and climb it in four or five days and it's just too fast. You reduce your chance of getting to the summit, um, you increase your chance of being sick and it's, it's not fun. And you know, if you're spending the money to go to South America or to Africa or even to go trekking in, in Asia, then take your time and, and enjoy it. Don't rush. Um, the combination of tropical and travel medicine along with um, the mountains. I think this is really important because a lot of mountaineers are purely interested in their sport and as be people become more adventurous they go to climb in more and more interesting places and we can give them really good advice by telling them how to prepare to be healthy uh, when they're climbing the mountains and also what to look out for when they come back because there are many diseases they may not know about that so uh, there's a range of extreme environments, um, the most extreme of which is probably being in, in outer space. There is nothing in space that can support anybody. I think on Earth, you would have to then say that diving is the most extreme because if you're underwater and you run out of oxygen, then also it, it's a problem. On land, then really you have three main challenges. You have heat, you have cold, and you have altitude. Um, if you're too high up a mountain and the weather's okay, you can come back down and then that problem goes away. Um, if you're too hot, it can be a very big problem. You can die from, from a heat illness and it's very hard to cool down. Also, if you're in a very, very cold environment, if you have uh, the ability, then you can put on some more clothes or find some shelter and you can get warm and then you'll be safe. But if you if you can't get warm, then also you can die in cold environments. So all of those are challenging. I think what's interesting about this conference is that we have, uh, with the altitude, you can have, you can be cold at altitude, you can be hot at altitude. So you're now getting a combination of extreme environments, which is even harder for the body. So that's very interesting. Uh, I, the new film about Everest is, is really spectacular. The, the cinematography is amazing. They actually went to Everest Base Camp, so the footage is, is real. Uh, one of my friends was the doctor on the trip, so I know that he tried to give them um, good advice. I think some of it was also filmed in Italy, which, which, which is interesting. Of course, with any film, the, there is some relaxation from the true story, but I think for anybody who is wanting to understand what it is like to climb Everest and the mistakes that were made in 1996, then I think the film does that very, very well.